Hey everybody, Wayne here. An unboxing video today of Gorbachev, The Fall of Communism, a solitaire board game, war game, excuse me. Game designed by R. Ben Madison, published by White Dog Games, part of Ben Madison's Cold War trilogy. I'm sorry for a little bit of glare, it looks like. Once I, I think once I take the plastic off, it won't be any glare. Um, so... We'll look, I guess we'll look at the back here, but I'll tell you right now. So it's like a uh, stage of siege game. Um, ben Madison, he um, sent a bunch of the American Revolution game. Um, Don't tread on me. It's called um, Mrs. Thatcher's War, and oh, what's the other one? I can't remember. He's another one. It's part of a, a British trilogy, I think it's called, or something like that. Anyway, let's go on to this one though. All right, so this is a new release from White Dog Games, like I said. Gorbachev, The Fall of Communism. Oh, and then a little quote from Vladimir Putin here. The demise of the Soviet Union was the greatest geopolitical catastrophe of the century. Unbiased opinion from Putin. Comrades, take a wild nostalgia trip back to the 80s, the golden age of nuclear paranoia, alternative music on MTV, and five and a half inch floppy disks. In Gorbachev, the fall of communism, you are thrust into the leadership of the Soviet Union, trying to push your immense country into the democracy amid the collapse of socialism and the wild mood swings of Gorbachev himself. In this fast play, fun, and educational solitaire game, five converging paths represent the political awakenings of the Russian people, the Baltics, the Caucasus, Central Asia, and the Communist Party itself. Any of them can spin out of control and force the Soviet army to overthrow you and desperate bid to turn back the tide of freedom. This so all takes place in a dangerous world of ethnic riots, earthquakes, the Chernobyl nuclear disaster, and other nightmare scenarios. Very cool. I'm not going to read the last paragraph. Um, very cool looking. Ben Madison, Ben Madison. Michael Kennedy produced. Thanks to Dan Leveloff for inventing this format of war game. And to Steve Carey for the innovations that led to this game. So Dan Leveloff, he did, um, I think Israeli Independence was the first one. So the first States of Siege game. Um, published by what Victory Point Games, and then Steve Carey has done. Uh, he's on Board Game Geek. Great guy. Um, chat with him. Me and him like a lot of the same games. Just saying. So see if I like this one. Pretty standard stuff here. So of course, cells are only old medium, thirty to sixty minutes. Very cool. All right, let's open this bad boy up. Let's get her open here. Enough fooling around and. Read in the box. It's got that like hard plastic. Ugh. Get it open. A little sliver here. There we go. Alright, well, lesson in how not to take plastic off, I guess. Alright, let's crack her open. So we got some cards. I assume these are, you know, standard states of siege style where Yep. So I'm sure you draw one per turn and then you know go down and do in order type of thing. I'm not gonna read through them because I don't wanna kind of spoil anything that's going on here. Little sleeve, put them back in there for now. Riveting. Riveting video here, folks. I know. Sorry. All right. Counter sheet here. Oh, professional version counters. I guess I'm glad I have the professional version. Glad I don't have the unprofessional version. But I'm just... So I assume different um, sections of the map, um, special events. Disaster, minor strike, disaster. Armenian earthquake, disaster, Chernobyl. So, different uh, Gorbachev, Yeltsin, etc. Oh, and NVD security, KGB, Putin on there. Frank Sinatra. It's just solid black. So, okay, one side of counters here. Our trusty will die here. I don't think. 
standard rule book for case style. 7.2.7, What are we looking at here? Again, I'm not gonna read the rule book as usual for my unboxing. We'll flip through here. We're kinda some pictures, guides. What is it we're looking at here for the total actual? Oh, that's the half, that's the designer notes. Um, rules, rules, rules. 12, maybe? Looks like page 12. The actual rules for the game. Go to 12, maybe? Oh, it is. And there's some designer notes in back. It look like we're, I assume Ben Madison talks about tour the Soviet Union. Hmm. All right. What else we got here? That's a couple more things coming. I know we do. All right, so we have our... Uh, Counter tray for easy setup. Is this a guide on how to use your counter tray, maybe, or something like that? How to set up the counter tray? I don't know. That's cool. Sequence of play down here. An event sheet, looks like, it's for those. You know, the minor, talking about the minor strike, Chernobyl, etc. See? I didn't lie. And, oh, an example of play. Full example of play. So nice. So not in a rule book, but right here on the back of the sheet. So which honestly, you probably need to use it once anyway. So very cool. A couple of the uh, black and white, but oh, seem to be set out nice. And I like having the sequence of play. You guys know if you see them in my videos, how I do my games. I set them up, set up my player aids along the wall here, across my table, so I can basically just look up and look at them. That's the way to do it for me. All right, and the map here. Get this bad boy out. Nice uh, smaller size map, as expected. Folded. I'll either probably put my um, uh, plexi right on here. To you know, it's a small, it's a small map, so it's like kind of funny putting big plexi on here. But oop, I'm gonna get all the way on here. So that's to hold it flat. So that or counter fold it, I suppose. Watch me tear it on video here, and you guys get to see me destroy my map. Up a little bit. Okay, all right. I'm just trying to show it up here. I'm not playing yet. So, map's got a lot on it, but the color coding looks nice. So, I assume where the cards go. Polybureau opposition, support, five-year plan, media and culture, military. So, get those going. Um, uh, and here's obviously the tracks, right? Coming in, coming in, coming in. Coming in, coming in. Moscow coup. So, states of siege style, obviously, as we, we talked about. So, trying to push back, you know, keep each thing, which looks like, but there's a lot more to it than just, you know, them coming and you rolling dice. Looks like, it looks like there's a lot more to it. It's a 12 page rule book, which is probably larger than most of the states of siege games. Um, other than like maybe a really elaborate game like Wars of Marcus Aurelius. All right, well, that is Gorbachev. I don't want to spend too much time on this one. It's, you know, a small box game here, but. Looks good. I think, you know, I can't wait to get this one to the table. Hopefully I'll be able to do some playthroughs and such. Um, Gorbachev, Fall of Communism from White Dog Games. Designed by Ben Madison. Check it out. All right, guys. Later.